Hey, min älskade korv. <laughs> Just eating some before we go. Wow. This is incredible. Look at this. Ja, ja, grim. Wow. It really is cold today. Oj, 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 oj. Ska vi gå på promenad? You can, you know what? We could have eaten that when we got home. Kan du gå med mig? Vi kan vänta. Se ut. Sit. Sit. Du måste sitta fast i den här. Grimbjörn, här, kom. Why are you like panic eating? You have had this food out for as long as... Nej, 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 kom tillbaka. Sit. Sit. Stop mucking them around. Sit ner, min lilla sötis. That took so much longer than it should. All right, we're ready to go. Wait, we need to close the door. There. Look, there's like ice everywhere. Hello. This is one of the most beautiful days in a really long time. I am so much more a winter girl than a summer girl. Because this weather gives me life. And grim. <laughs> Stop it. So now that we get some snow and we actually get cold weather, I'm so happy. It's morning here. Well, it's ish morning. It's not really morning, is it? But we're going on a walk. Wow. Let me show you. Look at this. Is this for real? Look. It's so beautiful okay now we have to walk i look a little bit rough today that's what happens oh yeah, yeah, yeah. i have no words it's so gorgeous okay we're gonna walk now Ever since I moved to Svalbard in November six years ago, I've loved the polar night. After an intense summer with four months of midnight sun, comes the darkness with peaceful and quiet days. It's a time to focus on the calm and enjoy the beauty of the small things, like a clear night sky or just the perfect cup of coffee. The time leading up to the polar night is equally as beautiful. I love watching the landscape change. From one day to the other, it's been transformed. It's always exciting waking up to a white world with shimmering blue ice on the streams, fresh arctic air and the perfect sound of snow crunching underneath your boots. That's pure happiness to me. I love winter. I am a winter girl through and through. In winter, I feel most alive. Look. Hör du sett, Grim? Hör du sett så fint det är? 
You want to go with this? I have some boring candy in here. Yeah, somebody wants a little treat. You don't even like these. They're little square puffs. I should go for being beautiful. Do you want another one just for being beautiful? Yeah, come. He doesn't even care. You're the fiend. Wow. It was so nice to get some sun. But it's over there now. Look, it's just the end of it. It's gonna come around later though. I feel like we have to treasure the last of the sun now. It's only, what, like two or three weeks until it goes down for this year. Oh, it's just incredible. This day is one of the most beautiful ones in a very long time. And Grim is so happy. Are you glad, Grim? Yeah. And it smells like it's so strongly scented of like winter and cold and crisp and oh. And I think somebody has a fire going somewhere because I can smell it. And it's also the best smell when you have this bonfire in Arctic cold air. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I cannot get enough of this. Like it turns, you know, pink almost. There's this really strong blue and then you have the white kind of turns pink in the sunlight and the clouds are pink. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm sorry, but I cannot say it. Oh, I cannot not say it. Hey, Kim, come with us and Kim. Yeah, come. <laughs> Hello? Come now. I'm about to say, hey, come hit. Had. Bra. Bra. Okay, sit and go. Sit. We would like to ask you, what do you think about today? Huh? What do you think about today? Mm. Oh. oh. That, was, that was a lot. I don't know why he thinks that anybody would want attack kisses. He kissed me in my eyeball. Well, thank you, Grim. Thank you so much. Okay, I need to go down here and take a photo because this ice is gorgeous. Grim, you said go to cool tad, okay? Yeah. Look at this. Why are you so excited to go here? Look at this ice. Beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? It's starting to get a bit colder out now and temperatures are dropping just below zero degrees Celsius. Our main source of heat in our cabin is a heating unit, which looks just like an air conditioning unit that is mounted on the wall. But then we also have our wood stove. The wood stove is great for some extra heat and mainly for coziness. But since we don't have any trees on the island, Svalbard is well above the Arctic tree line. Using only the wood stove would be quite expensive. The wood we buy has been imported from the mainland and it cost 160 Norwegian kroners for a 40 liter bag. Even though we have active coal mining on the island, it is not something we are using in the wood stoves and cabins. 
Right now our village is heated through central heating using coal at the power plant, but this is set to be changed to a completely different system in about two years, and the last active mine in Longyearbyen will be closed. This is absolutely insane, as I like to say. Or maybe I should say it's beautiful. <laughs> but seriously, this is the October I've been waiting for. Like the rain that we've had before today or yesterday, it broke me because it was so sad. And now finally we have this October, which is cold. I think it's minus five degrees right now. And it's crisp and the pink skies. It's so difficult to explain like what this looks like. I, you'll, you're getting a good idea, but it's just like, it's even more beautiful when you're here. And this is like what October is about. So I think it's gonna be pretty much, if we're lucky, it's gonna be like this. It is so pink. It's so vibrant. I can't. I'm gonna take in our sheets now because they've been out and airing. Oh, that's cold. Which is good for them. Make them super fresh. I love airing our sheets. I love it. It's serious. It's just getting more and more pink. How am I supposed to go? I'm going to badminton in about how many minutes? 10. I'm gonna bring you guys. Oh, you can see me and Lynn were playing badminton today, so I'll, sh I'll give you a bit of it before I end this video. But wow. Are you seeing this? Like, how is this even possible? And this happens every time the sun is setting, like towards the season, and then it happens again in February. But in February, we have more of what we call blue hour. We have a full month with blue hour. Now we have like pink hour. <laughs> it's a little bit chilly. Oh, my hands are like struggling. Whoa. What, like, I don't even know how to capture it. I've, t I've taken like 4,000 photos and I still feel like I need more. But I have to remember there, there's gonna be another day like this. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, it's cold. Every time I do that, it's super cold. I try to air our sheets a couple of times a week. When it's this cold, it's perfect to get them all fresh. This is my new sweater, by the way. It's from Zara, believe it or not. It looks like it's home knitted, but it's not. I need to, no, I actually, I was gonna say I wanna learn how to knit. I don't. <laughs> I knitted once a beanie for Christopher and that was enough, it took me. Cause you know, I can't like put it down and like chill and take it, like I knit like a maniac for four days, you know, just like to get it done. So it's not very calm. <laughs> Okay, let's look at the view together. I'm gonna be on your side. Come on, guys. Okay, let's stand here, everybody. Take a deep breath. And look at this. Just look at this. It's incredible. Oh, these are so cold. This is over my color. I'm 
back. How is that? Is that nice? I thought so. I thought I would give you some alone time with this view. You know, you need a minute to soak it up and like take it all in. Is it cold? A little bit cold? Okay. Let's go inside. Let's go play badminton. I need to get ready to go. I'm already late. Thank you. 